So we're here, usually what happens is, you know, both hands will stay in, right? Uh, if, if you're lucky. So he'll go and try to do the arm bar. So he'll pull this over, get here, boom. As soon as this happens, I don't want to stay here and I don't want his hips to be 90 degrees. If his hips are 90 degrees, it's super easy for him to then pull and extend and I'm there. So since we're wearing a gi, what I like to do is take both my hands that are stuck in here. I'm gonna grab one collar, one side of the collar. You can do two if you want, but I just kind of do this. Grab it however you can. And I'm gonna start pulling myself into him. I'm gonna make him kiss his knees. So start pulling and I'm gonna start driving up here. Now, to get a little bit better of a, a thing going on, I'm gonna take, uh, and I'm gonna start turning my left shoulder towards him, so the shoulder towards the head. I'm gonna turn towards him, and that kind of drives his leg close to him. And then as we're here, he doesn't like it, so a lot of times the grip loosens up. I'll pull the arm out, and I will come around the side. You get like the side control thing, right? Where I start kind of coming around, and I roll my hips over, get this arm out, okay? So again, as this happens, we don't want to wait to the last minute. Like we said, don't wait till your arm is all the way out. So it's here, they usually grab. Right about now, I know. I start grabbing here. I know what's about to happen. I'll grab here, grab there. So this leg comes over, as soon as it comes over, I start driving in. Really make him start to kiss his knees. To help pull my arm out, I'm gonna to start to roll my shoulders. So shoulder closest to his head, I roll. So my body does this, dropping more weight into this leg dropping more of my head into here. But I'm using this to pull him out. Notice also his hips are no longer 90 degrees. So I start turning, looking away. And then the arm that's in danger, I pull it out. Then I'm gonna come all the way around. Big come around, and I'm gonna travel around. Cut the corner, come around the hip, the legs, whatever I need to. The whole part is, Kiss the knees, kiss the knees, kiss the knees. If their hips, back, and legs are 90 degrees, they're super strong. If it opens up like this, that means you're getting hard part. But if I can collapse this 90 degrees, that's where it is. And sometimes we call it like crock pot. Where you sit there and you slow cook, you just crock pot. So I'll pull myself in, and I don't try to immediately get my arm out. Because if I pull this in, then my elbow's being bent at the same time, right? So if I pull this in, my arm's being bent, and I'm dropping my weight in, they're trying to kick me out, but I'm pulling myself in, I'll literally just sit there and just slow cook them. Pop, pop them. Pretty soon, they're, they're wanting me just to, they'll, they'll start letting go to, they're just like, it's terrible. I'm bending them in half, you know what I mean? Playing origami with their body. 